For the last four years, I've had the honour of working with you as your Greens MP. Together, we have been the real opposition to the coalition government. We have successfully put a woman's right to choose back on the front page after decades of silence. We've exposed the failings of WestConnex, led the campaign against land clearing laws and fought to keep public services in public hands. In the last four years, we've also seen our hard-won social, economic and environmental gains under threat and the rise of the far right, both at home and across the world. These are complex problems which require us all to step up and fight for the things we believe in. And that's why I'm running to be your next New South Wales Senator. I believe that if we want to fight the resurgent politics of fear and ignorance and division, we must build a stronger, bigger, more diverse party. A party that engages the skills and perspectives of our members and our communities and puts them front and centre in a shared democratic future because we do not open ourselves to solutions by shutting voices out. I believe our party is mature enough to have the tough conversations about who we are and what we stand for, and dynamic enough to have the ideas we need to solve the unprecedented challenges of the 21st century. And frankly, we have to, because the old ways of vested interests, backroom deals and partisan personality politics do not work. Together with you, I am proud to have exposed the incompetence, injustice and the agenda of privatisation entrenched in neoliberal politics. But I am prouder still when the Greens offer real alternatives. Because it is not enough for us to stand on our ideals. If we truly believe in them, we must bring others on board. We must be willing to make the case for change across the community, the country and across the aisle. Because now, more than ever, we need to come together and put our focus on what truly matters to us. It matters to me that we build a society that dismantles systemic racism and discrimination. It matters to me that young people have the opportunity to create a bright future through free education, affordable housing and fair wages. It matters to me that we stop wasting billions propping up the coal industry while our chance to act on climate change slips away. And it matters to me that we do everything in our power to protect our precious environment. Because in my 25 years as an environmental engineer, I've never seen it under more extreme threat. Over the last four years, I have been inspired and energized by your courage to stand up for what matters. And now with you, I want to take up the fight in Canberra. Together, we can shape a brighter future built on the principles of grassroots democracy and social, economic and environmental justice that has driven us from the very beginning.